Uh, now there's a string of shootings in Sacramento, some linked to gang activity, others still being investigated as gang crime. Community activists putting out the call to stop the shootings. CBS 13's Madison Keevy joining us live in the studio right now, getting answers with what's led to this uptick in gun violence, Madison. Right, and, and many of the victims still in their teens, so young. So we asked this question, you know, this most recent public shooting that turned Vintage Park into a chaotic scene. There was even a gender reveal happening nearby, interrupted by a gang fight. So the question for law enforcement, does the county have a gang? problem or a gun problem. Come out of the front door with your hands up, nothing in your hands. The consequences of a gang fight at Vintage Park on Saturday led to the Sacramento Sheriff's special enforcement detail and both Sacramento and Elk Grove police SWAT executing search warrants on Sunday. You need to come out, open the front door, put your hands in the air, nothing in your hands, walk out to a bent front door, signs of the weekend in a now quiet Carmichael neighborhood. So I walk out of the house, I'm ready to leave, I'm just running some errands, and I see like four SWAT trucks pull up, and there's like six guys on each one, guns out, you know, I'm like, what's going on? Rafael Ramirez is in custody and faces a murder charge for the death of a 17-year-old who was described as an active participant in that gang fight by law enforcement. We do have a gang problem. Uh, let's not shy away from it. There's a gang problem in Sacramento, uh, and it's not just in these, you know, uh, small areas or small pockets. These things are occurring everywhere. It's occurring where you live. It's occurring where I live. North, south, east, and west, it's there. Is a recent string of shootings a gang problem or a gun problem? Sac Sheriff's spokesperson says it can be both. You've got criminals that have violent histories, criminal histories that are out in the public, breathing the same air as you and I, walking the streets just the same as you and I when they should be incarcerated. Gang arrests happen daily. Many of them have guns, but and they're out before the ink is dry on the report. Ask neighbors who live near this scene, and there's some that are unsettled, not knowing their neighbors may be linked to crime. It, it, it does feel good knowing that there's people out there who are stopping this kind of, you know, the criminals and stuff like that. Uh, but it's also weird because there, there are criminals, right? Yeah, one of the other questions is just why that large of a law enforcement response And the Sacramento County Sheriff's Office says they took every precaution they could to make sure it ended the way it did, which was peacefully.